Hi. From beautiful Portugal in the lemon tree, between the lemon tree and this beautiful one. With all these new sound creations in it. <laughs> so I wanted to say hi from this beautiful spot in southern Portugal where I've been co-creating and learning from and with the bees and the trees and um, really whew, it's been such an expansive, expansive, expansive time of having the bees show me so much of how my way of seeing things has been too small. Um, it's been expanding my horizon and those beautiful bees that um, show us that they are the weavers of the web. They are co-creating they are um, it's like when they are on a piece of land then they weave the web of life on that land and they regulate it and they work with it with all the plants visiting all the plants vitalizing the plants um, any flower they visit is being vitalized as well as pollinated. So there's much more going on. And during this time that I was here, this last six weeks, so about half of the colonies that we were looking after in this beautiful co-creation, have died. And we were really with this question, what is required for those beings that are actually creating, maintaining, sustaining life, be to be supported. Um, and we were really shown how so many influences from the environment like um, toxins, like EMFs, like many other things, really, really, really make it so hard for those who wish to sustain and maintain life to be able to do it. So um, we've been looking into so many different things of how can we support um, both the bees and the trees and all those beings and plants and animals and energies that are really wishing to co-create with life. And sound has been part of that. Like, what sound, what vibration, what energy can we be to support and strengthen that web? And I was, in one of our sessions, we were shown this beautiful breath of really bringing the breath from the center of the earth out like through the roots of the trees and out through us and through our crowns and out and around the planet and back. And it's like including that breath, including the earth in our breath. And so I was feeling to create bells, instruments, that actually 
are created from that breath and bring energy and vibration to that breath, facilitate that breath. So I had this impulse to create bells and these things, these tinglings. that facilitate some of that, they're created with some of that breath. To facilitate that vitalizing breath. And it felt so like a gift to the planet, to ourselves, to each other, to the to nature, to the bees, to play these. So please receive those different sounds. And we have this feeling to also make them available in, as like Christmas gifts in our little, little shop. from which, from the sale of which, we would love to gift towards the tree sisters who are reforesting and towards the bee projects. So, if you feel moved or drawn to receive more than through this video, one of these spells, one of these sounds, come to our shop. And please use this breath that I described to gift to the planet and gift to the trees and gift to the bees. And if you'd like some assistance with that, through the sound, 